Hello everyone, my name is Wang Fu. I'm eight years old. I live in a large city and I study at the Guru Primary School. Nice to meet you. Today, today we are going to talk about um, wants and needs. Do you know what wants mean? Wants is a something you really want it. But you certainly don't need it to survive. Like this. That is the toy. It's a plate. I certainly don't need it to survive. This is a, a bottle. It is a shape. So it is a what? See, it is a little bit too tricky. This is water. Water is needs. Oh, certainly we don't need. You certainly we don't have water. We can't survive. Water is needs. I give you a trick. That is my new pep. Can you guess it's a one's a need? You answer it's a need. Certainly not. It's after that, it is a little bit uh, tricky because that they are paper with still books, books on it, but they are a uh, white. Hmm. How about book here? A dictionary. Shh. This is a dictionary. That is a dictionary, and it is a need. We don't need it. If we don't have it, how can we want it? It is a need. Oh yes, let me try to answer. This is a toys. Can you guess it's a need? Oh, what is a want? Certainly, I don't need to survive a plane. Hooray! I certainly don't need it. Because they are just toys. And they need toys. They didn't do anything. Paper. Oh, yes, that is paper. I saw in paper. Paper is needs. We need to use paper. But you, you need to. Oh, uh, not to waste paper is important. That means it is a neat. Paper is neat. But so a plate is a what? Really tricky. Mm -hmm. For all the trickies. Is this a what? Or is it a need? You know what it is? It is a... Sorry, not a want. It is not a toys. I use it to cut my hands. See? I can cut with it. See? Cut it up. They are a need. If they are not toys, they are something that you to cut the f nail on the finger. It is a what? So we learn wants and needs. They are really important to remember. But if you have uh, wants and needs, I want you to see it besides your mommy and daddy and say it loudly and say it loudly is it a want or a need? Next, we are going to talking about handing money. Hmm, handing money. Are you excited? Of course you are. Now, we are going to hand money. Will we spend it? Will we save it or will it income? In 
income means the money you do work, and yeah, you got some money. Like this. You do lots of work, like I have this computer. I turn it on, I work with it. I work for the information about the work I need to done. So, that means that I'm doing my work. And my income is falling much more. And I have more income. See? Is that interesting? Really interesting. That's good. So now you see it. Oh, yes, you see now. That is just a bit sad. So, the income that you must work for the company, work and you work, you get some money from the works you have done. That is an income. The spending money, like your, if you spend the money, like I, I will spend my money to buy some new toys, what I want, or what I need. Totally, you do it. Also, that you save your money and you do more income to get some more money. You save your money. You don't spend it. You save it. See? Interesting. Hmm. Oh, yes. I want to tell you something important. Give you a really tricky engine. That is called a playing word. Okay? In this game, you need to buy uh, important things first. You need to buy needs first and then the wants. Are you ready? Let's go. I'll give you a tricky question. Robert is going to the shop. He needs to buy a bike and he, he needs to buy some food. But he also needs a bike. What should he buy first? Food. Oh yeah, you are right. He needs to buy food first. Because it is important to buy food first. It's important. Food is interesting. And they are yummy, yeah. We need food supplies. That is it. Now is the last question. David is going to the toy store. He likes to buy a uh, rocket toys, but he also needs to buy a new car. Which one should he buy first? A toy rocket? G G. Especially not, because, especially not, because that we have says that we need to buy the needs first and then the want. So actually, it's going to be the car. Tish, mm -hmm. see? So in this game, next time you need to be more good. At it because it's really tricky. You also need to buy a niece first, then a want. Now, in the real life, you need to buy a you especially need to buy a niece first, and then the ones if you have enough money to buy it. Last. We are going to talk about making a coin piggy bank. Are you ready? Let's go. At first, we're going to like the animals we want. What are you? A chicken? Okay. Now we're going to build the chicken first. First, like you eat a snack and then you get a box with this lid. Good. 
Now, we cut some paper to pieces, just, just into a long slide, not a big, a big shot like a, um, like a ship, like that. We cut them into a long piece, very long. Then we just go. We cover the outside the the box or the snack with paper. Oh yeah, we glue it on. Good. Now we go into the sleep to eyes. We go to the sleep to eyes. Oh good. Now with all this stuff with your, we put it on. Hmm. Hmm. And there is speak. Good. But right now we are going to put the glue in on his feet. Let's put on his feet. Now, when you see that, you see his feet. Now, the Lord, cut a hole. Are you sure that will be enough for your cords? Good. Now, we go to put the rich guy on his head. Good, yes, rich guy. Mm -hmm. Good. Let's try to put some coins. We got some penny and coins. Penny and coins, I write the same. Let's put it on. So, you see, now you got the piggy bank. You can feel your money, and when it's much, much, much bigger, it's where with lots, lots of pennies. You can buy all. You can buy something you want, or something you really need. So, thank you for watching my video. I hope you like this lesson, and I will see you soon. See you later, friends. See you.